Good afternoon, Year 3 and 4. I hope you are all well and keeping safe. This half term in music, we are going to be learning about a musical group called Stomp. I'm going to share my PowerPoint with you so that you can see what I'm talking about. You have to bear with me for one moment. So normally, when we are thinking about percussion instruments, we would think about things like this. So drum kits, kettle drums, xylophones, congas, glockenspiels, steel drums, maracas, castanets, triangles, tambourines. These are what we traditionally think of as percussion instruments. But stump don't use any of these things. So how could we play music in particular percussion music without instruments. Have a think for me. How do you think we could use, or how we could play music without instruments? So to help you a little bit, we are going to watch a performance by Stomp. In this performance, they only use their bodies to create music. We're gonna be doing something similar today. So I've already tried to record this and this didn't show up. So I'm hoping now it does for you. Turn that volume up for you. Should be able to hear it now. Okay, so they only used their bodies when they were performing just then. I suppose this because you can still hear me. So they only used their bodies when they were performing. They clapped, they snapped, they clicked, they tapped, they stomped, stamped, and tapped. Can you do all those things? I know that you can do most of those things. If you can't click when we're clicking today, just do it silently. Just make sure you're hitting that B by trying to click. So we are going to be doing performance using body percussion. And we are going to be using this grid here and we're going to perform it. I'm going to go through it with you. Um, there should be a copy of this in your files so that you can see it, or if you're in class, you should have a copy of it. 
I'm going to close this now so that you can see me and we're going to work through it four beats at a time. should be able to see me. There you go. So we're going to work through this four beats at a time. I'm So first four beats, we're going to start off slowly, gradually getting faster. So we're going to stamp. I know you can't see my feet, let's put the camera down. So stamp, chest, Click. The chest click are half beats. So remember, a rhythm is a pattern of a beat. When I'm counting, that is the beat. We are creating a pattern within that beat. So the chest click are both half beats, but they're both on count two. So we've got one, one, two, one, two. So down chest click. Good. Then the first two beats. So we've got down chest click, down. First four beats. We'll slow that down a little bit. I know that was quite fast. So, down chest, click, down, tap. Let's try that again. After four, one, two, three, four. Down chest, click, down, tap. And again, after four, one, two, three, four. Down chest, click, down, tap. One more time. One more time, just for luck. One, two, three, four. Down, chest, click, down, tap. Good, so remember that, chest, click. Fast, that half beat, so we learnt about that. If you're in your four, we learnt about that in the African German. Okay, next four beats, so five, six, seven, eight. Starts off the same, we've got stamp, chest, click. Good, we can do that, just turn it. Remember, if you can't click, just do the action without the sound. So that you're still making that beat. So stamp chest click, and then we're going to go stamp rest. Remember, silence is just as important to music as the actual music. It's what makes it stand out. If we're all going silent at different times and carrying making noise, it doesn't make it dramatic. So we need to make sure we're resting on that beat eight. So let's do five, six, seven, eight after four. One, two, three, four. Stamp, chest, click, stamp. And again, one, two, three, four. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, rest. Good. From the beginning, first eight beats. So from the beginning, from number one. After four, we're going to do it slowly. Don't panic. One, two, three, four. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, tap. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, rest. And again, one, two, three, four. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, clap. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, rest. That's a little faster. Let's try it again. One, two, three, four. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, clap. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, rest. And again. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, clap. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, rest. Okay, I'm gradually speeding it up a little bit. One more time, pad faster. One, two, three, four. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, clap. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, rest. And again, one, two, three, four. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, clap. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, rest. Good, I need to have then. Okay, next eight beats, so next four beats, sorry. So we're going to do nine, 10, 11, 12. It's the same as before. We've already done it. It's the same as one, two, three, four. We can repeat it. Remember, in music, there is lots of repetition. So this is a repeat of one, two, three, four. So nine, 10, 11, 12 is just stamp, chest, click, stamp, clap. Easy, you've already learned it. Let's do it. After four, one, two, three, four. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, clap, and faster. One, two, one, two, three, four. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, clap. And again, one, two, three, four. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, clap. Good. 
the last line, the last four beats, 13, 14, 15, 16, is completely different to what we've already done. But don't worry, it's not too tricky and it's a little bit more fun. At this point. So we are going to pat our thighs from 13 and 14. So pat, pat, with another rest. Remember, science is important. And then we're going to shout, woo! Okay. So pat, pat, rest, woo! Let's put that together with 19, 11, 12. So we're doing 19, 11, 12, and equal to 15, 16. After four. One, two, three, four. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, pat, 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 rest. Woo! Good. Let's do that again, just 19, 11, 12, then equal to 15, 16. One, two, three, four. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, pat, pat. Pat, rest, woo! Good. Just try from the beginning all together. Don't worry, we're going to go slowly. To begin with, we gradually speed it up. Practice makes permanent. If you practice it too fast, incorrectly, to begin with, you'll just make that permanent. You want to make it correct permanent. So you start off slow, practicing it slow so you're getting it right, and then you can speed it up. We want to make it permanent. You also want to make it correct. So, after four, from the beginning, whole way through slowly. One, two, three, four. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, clap. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, rest. Stamp, chest, click, stamp, clap. Clap, clap, rest. Woo! Okay. Again, had boxes, so only a tiny bit. One, two, three, four. Stamp chest, click, stamp, clap. Stamp chest, click, stamp, rest. Stamp chest, click, stamp, clap, 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 rest. Woo! Good. I'm not going to say the words this time. I'm going to try and do it from the beginning. Same speed, not going any faster. We're going to try and do it from the beginning. You can just count in one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Keep in time with me. After four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Good. Again. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Well done. <laughs> okay, last time. After four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Good. I want you now to go away and practice that. Remember, start off slow and gradually get faster. I want you to be able to be able to do it without looking at the sheet by the end of the practice. If you can, if you're at home and not in school, if you can record it and send it in, brilliant. If you can't, I want you to perform it to whoever is home with your family or whoever's looking after you. If you're at school, you can perform it to each other. Next week, we're going to carry on with the stomp on and recreating our own compositions. So I really look forward to seeing any performances that you manage to record. As well, after you've done the performance, I want you to think about what you found easy, what you found hard, how your performance went, what went well, and what would you improve next time you did your performance? You don't have to write that down anywhere, I just want you to think about it. Okay, I will see you next week. I really look forward to seeing any performances that you can send in. Bye bye.